गुड हैबिट्स आर डिफिकल्ट टू फॉर्म बट ईजी टू लिव विद बैड हैबिट्स आर ईजी टू फॉर्म बट डिफिकल्ट टू लिव विद इट्स द सेंग ऑफ अरिस्टोटल डेट एवरी थिंग यू डू नाइन्टी फाइव परसेंट ऑफ एवरी डे एक्टिविटीज परफॉर्म्ड बाई यू इज द रिजल्ट ऑफ योर डेली हैबिट्स now before 2025 it's the drive time it's the time to shun all your past habits just cut out all the past habits from your personality from your life and so that you can speak english well before 2025 what are those five habits i am just giving you five habits five habits and you have the time of 3 months to prove that these habits are the crux of everyone's successful life and if you want to be a fluent english speaker just adopt these five habits and challenge these five habits for 30 to 35 days and if you are watching or if you are seeing the visible results in your personality in your spoken english continue them for the whole year and it will revolutionize your life number 1 habit you have to develop is become bulletproof to all gossips and opinions yes whatever people are thinking about you whether positive or negative just become bulletproof just close your ears to the gossips to the opinions of others and focus on what you are doing let them say what they are saying just focus on what your are goals what are your goals what are your targets and follow the path towards your success and always think about how you can overcome the hurdles the problems and the difficulties you are facing while passing or while walking along the way of your success because if you are just wasting your time on i'm are on listening to the other what others are seeing and if you are being influenced by the gossips by the opinions of others you will not focus on your goal and if you are not focused on your goal how can you devise a plan for your successful life so the very number one rule is become bullet proof to the gossips and opinions of others number second very important rule is very important rule control your own players it should not be the players that are controlling you rather you should control your players you should decide how much time you have to dedicate or you have to do on instagram facebook or whatsapp how much energy is you have to waste while scrolling on the social media you are deriving the players but these players should not derive you it's the deciding factor you have to be the owner of your own decision this is the right time you have to control your own players you have to decide you have to decide that these are my players yes i am getting the player yes i am getting the happiness out of these social media accounts but i have to limit all these things number 3 very important thing is that seek discomfort it should be in your habits that you should seek discomfort because the very first day or the very day when you start seeking comfort is the day when you stop growing so it should be your golden habit yet that you should seek discomfort if reading is your discomfort point if you, if listening is becoming hard to you if you can't just speak out if speaking is a challenge for you if speaking is a discomfort zone for you just seek that you have to do this because if you are seeking discomfort is the right time that when your mind will grow grow much in a much faster mode so whatever is a challenging area for you whatever is the weakest area for you whatever is the discomforting area for you just seek that just focus on that and you will see that how how or how much your mind is growing faster and your mind's capacity will increase day by day when you seek discomfort 
Number four, golden habit which you have to adopt is hard work is much more than your talent. Talent without hard work is nothing. If you want to do anything in your life, if you want to speak English better, hard work. Do your hard work and do focus on your work. Do work when you are not wanting when you are not just deriving when you are not wishing to do your work but you have to implement that talent is not working it's the hard work it's my work it's my dedication it's my devotion it's my constant struggle it's my constant effort even if i am not i if i am not wanting if i am not wishing to do this thing but this thing is good for me i have to do this this should be your mantra. This should be your golden habit. And the last habit, the fifth habit is the crux of all these habits is that the secret of change is not to fight the old thing, the old time which has been passed when you were not fluent in English. But the secret of change is to fight or to build on the new habits. What you are doing what you are going to do in the next month, in the next year, you have to plan, you have to fight, you have to build, you have to be concentrated. If you follow all these habits, you will see tremendous change because it's the change you, that will derive towards your destination of spoken English. It's the right time to decide and to cut your bad habits. Bad habits are the habits which are just the hurdles, which are just the difficult path and which are just the obstacle in your path of getting success. So these are the best habits. Just decide, just take a moment from your life, from your busy life and sit aside in any corner and decide what is, what are your bad habits and cut those bad habits and include these good habits and you will see tremendous change before 2025 because every passing moment cannot be retrieved back every moment is precious you have to utilize each and every moment so with this positive note i certainly end this video till the next video stay happy stay blessed thank you so much have a nice day